Major phone carriers make you sign contracts with rigid data plans to trap you into a kind of forced phonogamy. Sounds pretty insecure if you ask me. At Consumer Cellular, we believe in a more consensual and healthy form of phonogamy, free of contracts and more flexible to your data needs. This way, you stick around not because we force you to with contracts and fees, but because you love our phone plans. Like ardently love our phone plans. Phonogamously. Consumer Cellular. When Freedom calls, we're here to answer. Call us at 1-888-FREEDOM. Hello, it is Ryan, and I was on a flight the other day playing one of my favorite social spin slot games on Chumbacasino.com. I looked over at the person sitting next to me, and you know what they were doing? They were also playing Chumba Casino. Coincidence? I think not. Everybody's loving having fun with it. Chumba Casino is home to hundreds of casino-style games that you can play for free anytime, anywhere, even at 30,000 feet. So sign up now at ChumbaCasino.com to claim your free welcome bonus. That's ChumbaCasino.com and live the Chumba life. No purchase necessary. VGW. Void or prohibited by law. See terms and conditions 18 plus. Yeah. Gentry. I know him. Okay. 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 Let's Gentry, go. Henry. Henry, how are you? Thanks for coming on the show. Gentry, I am so happy. Yesterday, I did Access Hollywood. And part of the one game that they played was Henry with celebrities. How did you meet this person? The first picture was Shaq. And I was walking down a hallway. I was talking to a friend. I didn't look up. And I walked right into his belly button. He's a big guy. And he's a big guy, but he is a loving, wonderful guy. And ever since then, I have had the warmest relationship with him ever. Yeah, I mean, the contrast between the, you two with the, the size and the look, uh, completely different. But you guys have both survived in a entertainment business over a long period of time. And I think it's because you both have genuine hearts. Would you agree? I, You know what? I would agree. And it's funny that you should bring up the size because in the picture, I look like I might be a toothpick in his hand. <laughs> yeah, the Fawn's not looking so tough when he's uh, next to Shaq, huh? Well, he wasn't that tough in the first place. He was just... <laughs> A, a really good heart, and, and he had great sense of intimidation. Speaking of uh, happy days, it seems like you've been having uh, a lot of them. Uh, saw you dancing on TikTok with your granddaughters. Uh, wh- what's been going on with you, uh, Henry? Well, How have you I, been? Once a year, we make a TikTok. Uh, India and Lulu pick the music. Uh, this time, our 10 year old grandson, Ace, was in it. Uh, and I, I only make one a year. And the first one we made, we got like 14 million views. So maybe I'm an influencer. You are. I, I see that you do have a Twitter. You could follow our guest here. I at, love Twitter. Yeah, you, t- you tweet a lot. So make sure you follow at H Winkler for real. Uh, that's the numerical number for real. Uh, he's a fun follow. Also, this new show you're involved in. Very good. I think they casted the right guy. You play the part very well because you've actually done this role in, in the wild in real life. As you're an acting coach, tell us more about this show, Barry, that's on HBO. Barry is very simple. Barry, played by Bill Hader, is a hitman. He follows the person he is supposed to take out through a door. The kid now is in an acting class. So the man he's supposed to kill has a scene that he's going to do for the acting class, but no partner. So he chooses Barry who's just walked in behind him, pulls him up stage. All of a sudden, Barry says, I don't want to be an assassin anymore. I want to be an actor. And I'm his acting teacher. And then I become like his father figure. So I'm the father figure, not knowing that there is violence in this man, the likes of which I've never seen. This show, very popular, been picked up for another season. The latest season coming out uh, this weekend, April uh, 20th. This Sunday, can't wait to watch it. And nowadays, not like the old days, uh, Henry, where we had to like dig through the TV guide. We had to get the rabbit ears just right. Now you just speak into your remote. I'm so excited. I just hold down the the button and I just say, watch Barry on HBO with my buddy Henry. And boom, there you are. Isn't it? And there I am. Isn't it crazy? This year, I find out that Barry has killed the love of my life. She was a police officer. She fell in love with me. I fell in love with her. He killed her. Now, I'm so angry. I have a gun that Rip Torn, who was a a movie star years ago, used it in a film. And he gave me the gun. I take that gun. I put it in my bag. 
I call Barry. I say, meet me at my theater. You don't want to tell the whole story, man. Then we, we won't no, watch the show. So that's a, that's, no, the, I don't. that's the cliffhanger right there. That was the teaser. Our guest here, Henry Winkler, of course, the greaser, Arthur Fonzi Fonzarelli. He's uh, now playing Gene on the new show on HBO, uh, Barry, where uh, you are an acting coach. But in real life, you taught a master class for acting. And this is something you've been doing your whole damn life. Uh, what is the number one thing, if I were to take that master class, that you were teaching uh, that makes a great actor? And is acting something you can teach? You know, uh, if, if a person has the already the ability to want to tell a story and can get out of their own way, I say the most important thing is listening to what your partner is saying because then you know how to react. Listening, relaxing, and authenticity. Because every character ever written is in all of us. It's, it, we are all the same as human beings with variations. And if you can be authentic, then you can be dynamic. So you just need to really be yourself at the end of the day, it sounds like. Really, and then add on the conditions of what the writer has written about you, what other people in that piece say about you, listening to how these people are talking to you, and pretty much you all of a sudden you're on your way. It is Ryan here, and I have a question for you. What do you do when you win? Like, are you a fist pumper? A woohooer, a hand clapper, a high fiver. I kind of like the high five, but if you want to hone in on those winning moves, check out Chumba Casino. At chumbacasino.com, choose from hundreds of social casino style games for your chance to redeem serious cash prizes. There are new game releases weekly, plus free daily bonuses. So don't wait. Start having the most fun ever at chumbacasino.com. No purchase necessary. DTW, void, were prohibited by law. See terms and conditions 18. Plus. Hey. There's been some things I've read about you, Henry. Uh, I'll talk about the good stuff. Uh, this this book actually you wrote the the content for this one. Uh, it's Hollywood versus the Galaxy: Alien Superstar Number Three, which came out just a few months ago. This is a hot That's right. hot book for the kids. I'm curious yes, what it's uh, on it's, the New York Times bestseller list, and it's part of a trilogy. But really, what it's about it's about this alien who must leave his planet and lands on the only address he knows, Universal Studios, here on Earth. And it is, uh, we write, uh, uh, Lynn Oliver and I write, oh, this is our 38th book. And really what it's about is the children who are just a little different, who are always on the outside looking in, wanting to be on the inside. And how do you do that? And they're, fu- they're comedies, actually. They are comedies first and then whatever they are after that. Kids love an alien. I'm not sure why we reject the uh, the stranger at the door, but we run after uh, that that one outside the solar system. Why do you think that is? Why do you think we have such an infatuation with aliens? Do you know what? I don't know, but in my mind, I always have entertained the possibility that there's got to be life outside of this solar system. It just seems so natural to me. I am convinced that if uh, uh, if some ship lands in my vicinity, I will meet the aliens and they will be friendly. And, and that is no joke. That uh, I really do believe that. Let's hope so. Let's, uh, let's hope they're nicer than some of the people out there in Hollywood uh, that you have to deal yeah. with. Although there's been some really? great people. I know we're about out of time here, Henry. Uh, but I wanted to just mention some names of people that you've worked with or associated with, people you're fans of, and then you just give me a quick one-word, two-word answer as to what's Absolutely. the... First thing that comes to mind. Uh, First, Bruce Springsteen. I know you love the boss. Bruce Springsteen is one of my idols. If there is such a thing as reincarnation, I'm coming back as the boss. What about the Sandman? He gotten into the Water Boy click. A handful of his Uh, movies. Adam Sand. Adam Sandler uh, had me in the Hanukkah song. I called him to thank him for including me and I have been in five films with him and wouldn't you know the man doesn't call me back uh, he's busy he's, he's stacking cash as well uh, how about Ron Howard I'm, I'm sure Ron, Ron Howard. Howard is my is like my brother uh, he is um, incredible he looks like a loaf of white bread but he is a <laughs> most incredible director and friend 
How about Mary Tyler Moore? It was great seeing the two of you on screen together. That was the first show I ever did uh, in Hollywood. Uh, it will always be in my heart. Um, and she, Mary, uh, Mary Tyler Moore, that show was the Friends of uh, the 70s. And then finally, I'd like to ask you about your happiest day on Happy Days. Do you remember the pinnacle, the day you were playing the Fonz, when you said to yourself, you know what, I am, I'm really happy here playing on Happy Days? Do you know what? I will tell you, without fibbing, I loved every minute of those 10 years. I loved the family. I loved that we played baseball every Sunday together. We traveled all over the world playing baseball together. I lo Gary Marshall, rest his soul, taught me how to be an executive producer, how to, um, to be on set, uh, what the decorum was. Never a I bad day. That. There was never a bad day never. on the set there? There was only one bad day. In the seventh year, there was a phone booth in the corner, and of sound, uh, stage sound, uh, stage nineteen, and it rang, and they said, "Hey, Henry, it's for you." And I went up, and it was Ron Howard who said, "It's going to come out in the news uh, um, pretty soon, but I wanted you to know I'm not coming back. I'm going to be a director." And I thought my life was over because he was such a great acting partner. But it turned out that uh, Scott Baio uh, picked up the mantle and was a wonderful um, acting friend. In a world that's constantly changing, you have to move forward to change with it. At Strayer University, we see you striving to work harder and go further. That's why we provide you with the tools you need to get there, like offering a brand new laptop when you enroll in a bachelor's program, so you can do your coursework anytime, anywhere. Because our greatest strength is helping you unlock yours, so you can always keep striving. Visit strayer.edu to learn more. Eligibility rules, restrictions, and exclusions apply. Connect with us for details. Judy was boring. Hello. Then Judy discovered Jumbacasino.com. It's my little escape. Now Judy's the life of the party. Oh, baby, mama's bringing home the bacon. Whoa, take it easy, Judy. <laughs> The Chumba Life is for everybody. So go to ChumbaCasino.com and play over 100 casino-style games. Join today and play for free for your chance to redeem some serious prizes. ChumbaCasino.com. No purchase necessary. Void where prohibited by law. 18 plus terms and conditions apply. See website for details. After that. Well, many happy days ahead for you, Henry. We'll be checking out the show Barry on HBO, the new season coming out this Sunday. Uh, thank you so much uh, for your time, Fonz. Would you do me one favor? When you talk to or or if you see Shaq, would you give him a hug for me? Oh, I will. I'll give him a big bear hug, and I'll say that straight from Henry. I'll let him know. Go Lakers, baby. Absolutely. You bet. All right. See you, pal. Oh, my God. A pleasure, Gentry. In a fast-paced world, every day brings new challenges and new opportunities. At Strayer University, we know a thing or two about getting and staying ahead of change. For over 130 years, we've been providing students like you with innovative tools, customized support, and an education built to empower you. So you can find your way forward and always keep striving. Visit Strayer.edu to learn more. It is Ryan here, and I have a question for you. What do you do when you win? Like, are you a fist pumper? A woohooer, a hand clapper, a high fiver. I kind of like the high five, but if you want to hone in on those winning moves, check out Chumba Casino. At chumbacasino.com, choose from hundreds of social casino style games for your chance to redeem serious cash prizes. There are new game releases weekly, plus free daily bonuses. So don't wait. Start having the most fun ever at chumbacasino.com. No purchase necessary. DTW, void, we're prohibited by law. See terms and conditions 18 plus.